Welcome everyone, it's Sherry Carroll for Simon Says Stamp with a Funny Friday card and this is using the Art Impressions Feast Mode Stamp Set. I'm starting off with the Simon Says Stamp Large Tag die set and I have die cut some cardstock and also some watercolor paper which I'll be stamping on. The stamp set features several animals including a squirrel, a hedgehog, a fox, and a bunny and there's also some really fun messages to put with those. So I'll be using the Simon Says Stamp Intense Black Ink. I have my stamps positioned in my Misty. I'll just ink these up and I'm going to do both images at the same time. Once I have those well inked, I'll close the door of my Misty and using my sleeve I'll give this some good pressure. To color these in, I'm using my Mission Magello watercolors and I'm just doing a really loose watercoloring. So I'm starting off with light colors first. This is pretty washed out. And I'm just getting the outline of where I want that fox's orange hair and also the white hair to go. Once I have that color, I'm moving into just a little bit darker with less water and I'm just getting the outlines of the legs. When I say loose watercoloring, I'm allowing all these lines to appear. I'm not worrying about if I have any marks from my brush. I'm just adding in shading where I like it. I'm adding a purple sweater just like it has on the packaging. I do like to follow the colors that they suggest. And if you notice in my palette, I have several of my colors mixed together so I can go in, grab a little bit darker or lighter as I go. For the leaves, I'm using an olive green and I'm also mixing in a little bit of purple and also the oranges and I'm just letting them blend in together. So I'll do all my green at first and then I can go in and start adding some of my other fall colors by just touching into some of those areas where the other paints are still wet to get a nice mix of color. I always like to anchor my critters or my people and so I'm using a really washed out color. It's almost a gray brown and by really washing this out I can just add a little bit of shading right under my squirrel and my fox. Next I'm ready to add my message and I'll be putting this just right under the fox and this says thankful for you and I am using the Simon Says Stamp cobblestone ink. It's a really nice gray brown and I'll make sure I ink this up really well. And then I can close the door of my Misty and press down and get a really nice impression. I like to move my finger back and forth when I'm working with a really small stamp and I'll show you how this looks close up. It sits just perfectly under that fox. And using the same ink color, I am creating my message above my squirrel and I'm just giving that a little bit of pressure. And this says nuts about you. So these are super fun to create a couple tags. I've backed these with another tag cut from cardstocks and these do fit in our four bar envelopes if you'd like to mail these off. You can put your tags onto a regular note card or affix them to a gift bag to give as a gift. So I hope you've enjoyed these ideas using the Art Impressions Feast Mode stamp set and as always thanks so much for watching.